Welcome back to The Wandering Wind, where we focus on community to bring people together, creativity to let our inner selves out, and fun to make it all worth it. I am Gregory, and this is The Wandering Wind, and today we are talking about my favorite pastor, Rob Starnes. <laughs> pastor Rob, if you're watching this, please just know I love you very much, and you are awesome. Now, my favorite thing about my pastor now is that he is so excited for the Lord, so excited just to be presenting the message every week. I go in on Sunday morning kind of dragging my feet, kind of heavy-eyed, kind of, uh, it's a Sunday morning. And, you know, I know, I, feel, I know I'll feel better as soon as the message starts, but First thing in the morning, it's like, uh, I'm up too early. <laughs> and I see him at the door um, of the auditorium waiting to greet us. And he's all smiles and, hi, Greg. Hey, Sunshine, how you doing? He calls me Sunshine. I, I, I don't know why. I don't exactly have the air for it. And most times my my um cheery, dispos <laughs> cheery disposition is more like a... um. I don't know, like a candle more than a sun. I don't know. <laughs> um, but he welcomes me, and then we start worship, and after worship, he gets up, and it's like the entire room fills with this excited energy and this just wonderful spirit. Just, And it's I know it's not really him it's the spirit through him but he is so faithful to god that he allows god to work so completely in his life and in in his message it is just wonderful to see him work <laughs> god and rob and throughout the message i i remember going to my previous church with my previous pastor and going, geez, is the message over? Because the pastor would drone on and on and on. These and thous and yeas and yees. And it would be like, okay, can you make this a bit more, I don't know, engaging? Can you make it a bit more exciting? Or, oh, well, church isn't supposed to be exciting. Why not? We're talking about God here. We're supposed to be excited for God's message in our lives. Why can't we be excited? And Pastor Rob, first time I saw Pastor Rob speak, I'm like, well, this will be interesting because he, <laughs> he welcomes us and he's like, hi. And I'm like, hi. <laughs> and, and then he gets up and he's like, isn't it good to be here? And he... <laughs> Sometimes he gets so enthusiastic, so exuberant that he literally booms out of the speakers. And in fact, a couple weeks ago, sorry, Pastor, but I got, <laughs> I got a razz on you a little bit. <laughs> a couple weeks ago, he was speaking and he got really excited about something. And wouldn't you know it, one of the, one of the youngins, <laughs> one of the babies, must not have liked how loud he was because... They started <laughs> crying, and it's like, oh, so cute. Poor thing. Shame on you. <laughs> He's like, I'm so sorry. But I tell you what, he's an awesome guy, though. He's really, I've never really met anyone quite like, <laughs> quite like Rob. Um. Oh boy, Pastor Rob, what can I say about you other than that? You were just an awesome, awesome guy. Really awesome guy. I tell you what, I hope to always be amazed by how passionate you are for God. And I hope to one day reflect that passion in my own life so that people will see Jesus in me like how I see Jesus in you. Have a great one. Love you, Pastor Rob. I'll see you guys again soon.
Have a great, have a great day and God bless.